When employing people between the age of 16 and 18, there are requirements to ensure that they will be working safely. This involves carrying out risk assessments that would take into account their lack of experience in a work environment. Under the Health and Safety at Work Regulations 1999, employers have a responsibility to ensure that young people, those under the age of 18, are not exposed to risk due to a lack of experience or maturity, and therefore not being aware of existing or potential risks. The employer must consider the workplace layout and any physical, biological or chemical agents that they will be exposed to, and they need to consider how much training will be needed particularly training that relates to health and safety, and how they'll be handling the work equipment. They will also need to think about how the work and processes are organised and whether there are any risks from particular agents, processes and other work. In low risk environments such as offices, this should be a relatively straightforward process, but for higher risk environments much more attention may be needed to ensure that the risks are properly controlled. Employers should consider whether the work the young person will be doing is beyond their physical or psychological capacity and whether it involves risk of accidents that cannot reasonably be recognised or avoided by young people due to their insufficient attention to safety or lack of experience or training. Other considerations are whether the work involves harmful exposure to substances that are toxic, carcinogenic or could damage or harm an unborn child or chronically affect someone in any other way or whether it involves harmful exposure to radiation. Young people's exposure to radiation should be restricted and must not exceed the allowed dose limit. Additional consideration should be taken where the work is in an environment of potential extremes, for example noise, heat, cold or vibration. A young person who is not a child can carry out work involving these risks if their work is necessary for their training and the work is properly supervised by a competent person and where the risks are reduced to the lowest level as reasonably practicable. A child must never carry out such work involving these risks whether they are permanently employed or under training, for example undertaking work experience. Employers must also let the parents or guardians of any child know the possible risks and the measures put in place to control these risks. This can be done verbally or in writing.